Susan, you know, all great designers have an outstanding or almost an uncanny ability to describe their intent, not only their technical approach, but their designer's intent as well. The reason I bring this up is because you're, you're very, very good at, at, dis, at, at describing your intent. This is fantastic. This is out. I mean, this is crystal clear and it's very succinct too. So please keep up the great job in your written um, I can see you as an art director one day because number one, you're an outstanding designer, and number two, you're 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 very very astute at at communication, specifically in reference to design. So, those are really, really basic core qualities of of art directors. So, please keep up the great work in your in your writing, not only in this class but all your classes. It's just such a good practice for students to really develop an ability to describe their intent, their their technical approach, as well as uh, their their conceptual uh, their conceptual intent. Okay, and this is certainly certainly outstanding work here. So um, these are just outstanding. Uh, this is really really nice work here. Um, yeah, I've got comments on each one, but it, these are very 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 strong. And I think your the descriptions that you've used to. Um, to 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 assist the viewer to understand how you use blending modes is going to benefit the class, um, specifically students that are, are are not quite as astute as establishing blending modes. So just the description of themselves is um, is really really done very well. I, the, your your conceptual approach is fantastic. Love the crackle leak effect. Love the your use of blending modes. Really good stuff here. Um, Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at each one. Um, this is outstanding. I wouldn't do a thing. I think it's perfect the way it is. This one, actually, I, I take that back. One thing I would recommend that you might do is right now, I think that this bar right here is pretty weighty. And I think unnecessarily so. I think it's also kind of almost not harmonious with the background image itself. One thing I would recommend is come in here, don't change a thing but the color. And what is a really going to be a neat technique is, is coming in here and just eye dropping some area here, some color out of here to use for um, for the color bar. I think that's going to add to harmony and it's it's going to do um, uh, add in color consistency as well. So I think that that's a good solution there. This piece again, outstanding, I think. Okay, yeah, this, uh, this is another very good piece. Nice typography, good kerning, good kerning, nice job. Hey, who taught you typography? This is outstanding. Nice work. Your kerning is outstanding all the way around. So this is fantastic. <laughs> okay, so good job on your type. You definitely paid attention in your typography classes. That's fantastic. Um, I'm looking at each one. I'm going, wow, this is great. Wow, this is great. Wow, this is great. This is fantastic. Susan, these are outstanding. I wouldn't change. Oh, actually, I'm, I keep saying I wouldn't change anything. I would. Okay, on this piece right here, I don't think you need to pick up truck. I think that that a lot of times there's this aha moment. So we don't have to spoon feed our viewers as as designers. Okay, so the truck head into the levee. I mean, that's something that theoretically could come into place the first time the viewer hears the the, the words for um, American Pie and realizes that the let you know take the Chevy to the levee. I you know. But the levee was dry. I mean, this alludes to that without without spoon feeding the the, the Chevy to the levee. You know, this is just it, it'll make sense and it'll create an aha moment, and that's a powerful moment in, in graphic design, a very powerful moment. So I don't think we need the truck in this piece. Okay, third piece. This is so strong, and I love the the way that you've affected the water droplets with the, the blending modes. Really good stuff here. All right, I can't say enough about this. I just think these are fantastic. Love the muted background. This is this is almost washed out image, and de yeah, good stuff here. All right, so um, again, thank you so much. I think the work is outstanding, and I think this is definitely a, your writing is definitely a benefit to the class. I think students can benefit from your writing, um, and that's not only, and I think in all of your writing and in all of these assignments, so sorry. So, so please keep up the fantastic work, Susan. Really appreciate your effort and and the. Uh, the level of engagement that you're putting into your work. All right, great. Thank you very much. Please let me know if you have any questions at all.